Hey everybody, it's Tristan and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today, um, my hair is an absolute mess. I have not done it yet because I am at my salon right now. I'm about to get a haircut, but guys, a few days ago, I discovered something that about made me shit a brick. I was looking in the mirror, playing with my hair, then all of a sudden I see these. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. I don't know at all. I'll insert a picture right now if you can't. But I discovered a huge patch of gray hairs. Y'all, I'm 19 years old. Why am I getting gray hairs? My grandma Corti, my mom's mom, had the same problem. She went gray when she was like 20, 21-ish, but like I'm hitting it earlier than her. So I'm at my hairstylist right now, about to get a haircut. But I'm going to reveal to her this mess that is my hair right now. <laughs> no, I mean, I'll embrace it. I, I might get it colored. I don't know, not today, but I'm gonna show her these grays and I'm gonna get her reaction. I know this is a very abrupt start to a vlog. Um, I didn't know if I was gonna film it. I don't know if I'll be vlogging the rest of the day. This will be fit into another part of a vlog somewhere. This will be at the beginning. But anyways, I'm about to go in here and show her these grays and I cannot wait to see her reaction because I showed my mom and my sister. My sister, her jaw dropped and was very surprised and my mom just laughed. So this should be interesting. And hopefully by the end of this, this will look a lot better because this is a mess right now. And so is this. Okay guys, I'm at the salon right now and I'm about to show Shanna here this. She's camera shy right now. But just, <laughs> just come around here, lift up my hair right here on this side. Just do it. Just right here. lift it up? Just right here. What? Do you see them? <laughs> I know. Well, it's just Blonde. I okay. <laughs> no, my grandma Corti, the same thing happened to her. She started. It's like, your brother. Hard. Your brother's giving it to you. Okay. He's stressing me out too much. <laughs> yeah, I'm going great. I'm 19. I'm sorry. This, this is awesome. <laughs> Fantastic. My mom laughed. I'm not laughing. That's so bad. It's terrible. I'm gonna be getting colored for like the rest of my life. Okay, we're gonna get this mess cut now. Okay, guys. Shannon just showed me this picture of Stacy from What Not to Wear, and she has this one gray strip that's natural. Guys, that's what I have. Look at that. I'm becoming. Her. I love that. I, I want mean, that. That's what I try to get. Hopefully it just stays in this one spot. Like you said, it'll give it character just in that one spot. Exactly. Otherwise, I'm gonna look so old. I, like, I, like I said though, it's ironic because I tried to get this exact color like a year ago by dyeing it, but now I'm getting it naturally. And I don't know if I want it anymore. I love it. We'll, we'll see I what happens. I love it. Well, I'm glad you like it. <laughs> Alrighty guys, I just got this hair cut. It feels so good to have this all off my sides. I love it. She used this new beach clay on my hair that I absolutely love. I couldn't buy it yet because she didn't have it in stock, but I'm gonna be getting it within the next few days so I can get this awesome look all the time. But also here, I think you can see the grays better in my hair. I'm trying to show you there. Do you see that? I think you guys are getting a good shot, but I don't know for sure. Oh, right there, yeah. There it is, hell yeah. So I'm going gray at 19, so that's awesome. But right now, guys, I'm about to go home and edit some stuff, so I don't know how much I'll actually vlog today. I think I'm busy pretty much the rest of the day and nothing's gonna be interesting to vlog. So if this vlog doesn't pick up within this day, it'll pick up on another day, which you'll watch literally right now, so. See you then. Hey guys, okay, so it's two days after my hair appointment. I'm finally picking up this camera once again. So it's the day after the day after the appointment. Yeah. But right now I am on my way to go pick Taylor up from school right now. I figured I'd help my mom out and get some vlog footage in the process. So that's what I'm doing now and I'm going to stop vlogging and driving because that's dangerous. But I'll see you guys at the school. Hi Taylor. Hi. Oh, it's windy. Yeah. You know what? Perfect, oh good job. Let's hurry up and get out of here. I don't wanna be here anymore. Oh, I'm sorry, all my stuff's in the seat. So Taylor, how was your day? It was great, but it'd be better if I had a drink. True, let's go to Sonic or something. All right guys, well, as I was on my way home, we were gonna stop at a different Sonic, but Taylor wanted to go to one not by our house, so we're at one further out of our way. Mm -hmm. But the drinks are better, so I mean, it's fine. So we're gonna order and get some drinks, and then we're gonna go home, and I need a nap, and you need a nap, and we both need naps. Press the button. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Help. Hey guys, all right, I'm back. Um, it is actually the day after I picked Taylor from school. Can you tell that I'm really good at this vlogging thing? Um, yeah, I just didn't really have anything interesting happening last night. I just chilled out with some friends, but I'm picking the camera up again now, and I'm currently getting ready for a pink concert tonight. I'm so excited. I was supposed to see her like four and a half years ago for her Truth About Love tour back in 2013, but a thing for show choir came up, and I had to perform that night and had to miss the pink concert. And ever since then, I've been salty. I've been mad. I have not gone to see her. I'm so excited. 
excited I finally get to tonight, so I'm currently getting ready. I have my outfit picked out and everything, but I'm gonna do some makeup as well. So I guess I'm just gonna sit here and maybe talk to you guys a little bit while I do my makeup. All right, so I went ahead and changed into the shirt that I'm wearing tonight just so I wouldn't have to worry about getting a shirt on and off over my makeup. Was not gonna mess around with that, but I'm just doing my foundation right now. This isn't like a tutorial or anything. I'm just kind of chatting and getting all this done and chatting with you guys. But honestly, tonight my main goal is to not have flashback. Like, I don't want to have a flashback Mary moment like James Charles because I know I'm going to have pictures taken with Flash and I just do not want things to go south. I've seen many people, not just him, have that problem. And I just don't want to be one of them that has it. So we're going to be praying tonight that that doesn't happen for real because nobody has time for that. I thought I'd give you a good look at my baking. Like, as you can see, it's extremely attractive. Like, I should probably just go to the concert like this. I would get so many compliments. Hands down would be the best looking one there. Alrighty, guys. Well, here is the finished look. Very natural, very easy. We just got new lips, nude eyes, and some mascara on here. Nothing crazy at all. But I'll film a little bit of the concert. Maybe, probably, I'll take you guys with me. And yeah. I'm kind of hungry right now and I need to eat, but I don't want to mess up my lipstick. A dilemma indeed. But tonight's going to be extremely fun. I'm so excited to see pink. It's going to be literally the best ever. I'm excited. All right, guys, we are on our way to the concert right now. Um, my main worry tonight, I'm just hoping that my makeup does not melt off. Like, this holds up and doesn't end up looking like the worst ever by the end of the night. Like, that's always the goal, is to make sure that it always looks good. Are you excited? I'm so excited. This is, it's been a long time. Uh, seriously. <laughs> Four and a half years, give or take. November 2013 is when we should have gone. But we're not holding any grudges. <laughs> oh, no, absolutely not. No, no ill will here at all. But we'll see you guys there um, in the venue. I'm definitely gonna have to just film on my phone because they will not let me bring this in more than likely. So I guess I'll see you on my phone. Guys, she's starting, yes!
Okay guys, we just got out of the concert. We're back in our car now. Holy shit. That was one of the best concerts I've ever been to. Like, no joke, she's up there with Gaga. Like, you know, I love Gaga. I got I, lost okay. in that show. I've literally been to over 100 concerts. Seriously. Seriously, over 100 and oh my God. Like, wow, I was so impressed. That was insane. She's and amazing. the part where she's saying try, that forest scene that we were just talking about, like the whole stage came alive, like you said, and it was just so freaking spectacular. Like you saw part of it in this video. Oh, I don't even know what to say. It was so spectacular. Also, how the hell is she strong enough to hold herself up on those, like, what are they called? Yeah, the silk, like when it was just her and that one dude doing, like wrapping around each other. That was so impressive. Like I've seen videos of her do it, but in person it was like, like on another level kind of thing. And those tickets were pricey, but they were, I, I but can like see now why. Yeah, that show must have cost so much to put together and it was so worth it. Like that was one of the best concerts I've ever been to in my life. Pink slayed me. Her vocals were great and I want to go to another one. We should be in Oklahoma tomorrow. No, I'm kidding. We got to go. <laughs> Road trip. All right, hi guys. This is Tristan from the future who's editing this right now. But I forgot to say and meant to say that during the entire show, she was so personal with the audience. Like, she flew all over the arena and sang to every person in the audience, was sure to acknowledge every person in the audience, and was very sure to thank every single person in the entire arena and make them know that them being there meant the absolute world to her. Like, I could literally just feel how happy she was, and that, like, made the night even more awesome for everyone else, including myself. Like, she is just so awesome. And the people in the pit that were, like, right next to her stage, she signed stuff for them during mid-show and was sure to, like, high-five them and was, like, very tough touchy feely and personal and just loving with all of them and it was just really awesome to see and not a whole lot of people do that and she's one of them that does and it was just so freaking spectacular that whole night was just amazing but okay I'm gonna stop talking and let um past Tristan resume the video and sign off for y'all so I'll see you here in like a second okay guys well I hope you enjoyed what part of the concerts I filmed for you that was amazing. I'm still, I'm dead. I'm, I'm, I'm gone. But I'll see you when I get home to finish off this video. You know, you know what? I'm just gonna finish it off now. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like and a comment and all that good stuff. Also subscribe if you have not already and turn on my post notifications so you can be notified every time that I release a new video. Could you understand me? Probably not. I'm turning into James Charles. Hi. But I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of all over the place over the course of like three days because I'm just such a great vlogger, obviously. Also, shout out to the ladies who were beside us who were so nice and complimented me on my makeup and were just so great to be around and such good energy. Like, I love you. You're I amazing. Wish, I wish so many more people were like that. True. She, oh my God, they were so amazing and nice. I didn't even get their names, but you know what? Thank you for making that concert even better. But yeah, guys, I'll see you all in the next video. I love you all so freaking much. Have a wonderful night, day, afternoon, more, I, I don't know. But goodbye. I'll see you in the next video.